character animation and simulation might be reaching a new level in Houdini with the new procedural anatomy tool. SinFX Houdini has become a leader in creating realistic 3D simulations and with KineFX character animation, I think this has reached new heights of realism. Yet, using the traditional animation processes where only the bone movements and constraints are considered brings lack of crucial details. Details that make the simulation closer to realism like compressions and stretches of body parts along with the skin attached to them and consequential from the muscle motion underneath the skin. The tools developers brought a solution to the problem on the table for these subtle and important details with their new toolset called Procedural Anatomy, which they released the beta version of and they did this for free until the release of the LTS. Even with the Houdini muscle system, modeling muscles that respect the shape of the character and bone structure can be a long and tedious process which takes several hours to achieve, let alone synchronizing their simulations to the character's skin. But the developers of Procedural Anatomy, which can be considered kind of similar to Ziva Effects, which is in turn sold by Unity, confirms that they have been able to simplify this complex process or more like a whole workflow of modeling, animation, and simulation that has been condensed into one tool to create realistic anatomy and accurate muscle behavior. And based on their demo videos, it does seem quite simple to make adjustments with snappy features that make the setup of the joints and skeleton faster, keeping them within the body, and giving meticulous control over the details for more accurate anatomy, which is really interesting. And for muscle creation, they will automatically be generated between the joints and the body using a type of volume called SDF or sign distance field that allows an inside vision of the body to replace a realistic and accurate anatomy perfectly fit in the character. Last but not least, when it comes to the animation, this will probably be smooth and easy to do using Houdini tools, and you will be able to animate and simulate the body direction in Houdini. And judging by how the tool is going, it will probably have an export feature with its official release, making it possible to switch to the other software when done with the simulation. And to use the beta version of Procedural Anatomy, you can sign up on their official website, and to get started inside Houdini, you will have to load it as Houdini Digital Assets. Also keep in mind that you will be able to use it till the 6th of August. What comes after that seems to be the subscription plans allowing you to use it weekly, monthly, or yearly. So the gist of it is that Procedural Anatomy is a tool that has been in the making for a long time by a team with 25 years of experience from visual effects and animation industries, giving you the possibility to have an adaptive human anatomy for any character that you can bring into Houdini, and this can make actually life easier especially as a character animator or as a VFX artist. And there you have it guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to this channel if you are new to receive more videos like this. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.